Leave it to me to do something like this. Of course, everybody knows it. You see it in capital letters. It says, do not use racing slicks. Do not use drag slicks, drag radials on roads when you are going to have rain. Straightforward. We were driving to Battle Creek. We did two hours of driving. It was perfect. The car was humming along, hauled ass down the airport runway, broke a record, and then had a feast. And on our way back home, this happens. Well, of course, it's my luck. My, for some reason, anytime I have something crazy awesome happen, I have something to balance it out. Now, I am a very happy person, and I'm a very uh, happy to be a live person. But in this case, we've lucked out because a lot of the parts that were damaged were parts that were already damaged to begin with. So I was able to bleed off enough speed and uh, keep the car at least somewhat safe. So you'll see some replacement parts coming soon. If you want to see the dash cam, of all things, it was my CTSV driving behind me. If you want to buy the dash cam, which I've mentioned it before, you know, check out the link in the description. To make it perfectly clear, yes, I love pushing my cars to the limit, but I'm not suicidal. What happened here is we were on our way back. We knew that there was clouds, but there was no rain. And as we went, it started downpouring. And the moment the car in front of me changed lanes, there was just fresh water with no tracks for me to follow into. And that happened. If you're somebody who has racing slicks, even brand new, these are uh, ET Street R's with slight grooves in them, that's not gonna help. You can see how little rain it took to get a car to flip around on the highway. We had 911 called on us and uh, we saw tons of ambulances, fire trucks, and police driving by while we were parked at a parking lot uh, nearby, but everything turned out fine. The car overall is in good condition. I just have a torn fiberglass reinforced uh, front bumper. Uh, a scratched 99 spec headlight and um, a little bit of a damper on the end of a wonderful day. This is a hopefully a good lesson for those younger guys out there or even the older guys like me that are dumbasses that need to see what happens even with brand new racing slicks. So this is a very fortunate situation that resulted in a video that might save one of you from having the same thing happen.